Hello everyone, welcome back to X Machines channel. Glass is a very common material in modern life today, it appears everywhere, on the window where you are working, on the glass of water you are drinking, on the chandelier hanging in your house, on a soft drink bottle you drink refreshments. Have you ever wondered how they are made? In this video, X Machines will explore it with you. Raw materials of glass bottles include sand, soda ash, limestone and cullet, recycled glass. Depending on the required quality and production know-how of each company, this ratio may vary. All these ingredients will be mixed and put into the glass melting furnace at 2850 degrees Fahrenheit, which is higher than the temperature of molten lava. Here molten glass will be pumped through pipes and cut into small pieces. Depending on the bottle size, an amount of molten glass will be cut, this amount has been calculated and controlled by the management system of the production line. Here each piece of molten glass is evenly divided into different paths, where they are transferred to each glass bottle mold. Melted glass called gob, the original condition of a glass bottle. The gobs are delivered into the molds two times, air is fired into the mold expanding, and sculpting the glass many shapes and many sizes. At this point, the glass bottles have been formed, they are automatically picked up by the robotic arms and pushed to the chain, where they are transferred to the next stage. Depending on the specific requirements of the size, design and pattern of the glass bottle, there will be separate molds for the type of bottle to be produced. At OI company's largest glass bottle factory in the world, they make 5 million bottles per hour, 24 hours a day and 365 days a year. The glass furnace always work 24-7, never sleep to make sure stable temperature and reduce energy waste. The glass bottles are reheated then very slowly cooled to room temperature releasing stress as the new bottles emerge strong and durable. Glass bottles will be thoroughly checked for size, color and perfection to ensure that there are no small defects on the bottles before finishing the production process to pack and deliver to customers. Next, X Machines will take you to visit Riedel's world-famous handcrafted wine glass factory. This is a wine glass company owned by the Riedel family, based in Germany. Over 11 generations, the family has always focused on the design, research and production of wine glasses. Riedel continues to lead the way in modern, functional glass products. This craftsman is making sommelier wine glasses. This is a line of wine glasses first introduced in 1973. Up to now, it has existed and developed for nearly 40 years. Sommelier is the world's first collection of wine glasses shaped specifically for drinking, handcrafted with crystal glass. Claus J. Riedel is a member of the Riedel family, belonging to the ninth generation. In 1985 he created a revolution in wine glass design, with the perfection of glass design in its essence, bowl, stem and base. He was the first person in history, 
to realize the influence of shape on the perception of alcoholic beverages, which is the main reason why, he designed the Summer Liars line of thin, makeup-free wine glasses. Clause J. Riedel worked with experienced tasters and discovered that, wine enjoyed from specially designed glasses shows better depth and balance, than when served in ordinary cups. He designed each glass to adhere to the Bauhaus design principle that form follows function, adapting its shape to the character of the wine for which it was designed. Each sheet is carefully ladled and brought to the mixing table. The workers will deposit that glass onto the mixing table and back away. Table man carefully mixes his glass with a two-pronged fork. Once the glass is blended to his specifications, he picks that molten mixture up and feeds it between two rollers, sort of like two rolling pins that work together, that will mash that glass flat to one-eighth of an inch thick. The ladles that these employees use are very heavy. This is no job for a lad. Empty, they weigh 20 to 50 pounds. Full, they can double that in weight. In this video, let's watch how artisans in Mexico skillfully shape a multicolored glass vase by hand. Glass blowing is truly mesmerizing to watch, the hot glass is like treacle, one false move and you have to start over. Baccarat is a famous brand of high-class crystal glassware based in France. Its best-selling Mille Nuit Flutissimo Champagne Flutes, cost between $520 and $600 for only two.
Baccarat puts the raw materials into furnaces that exceed temperatures of a scorching 4000 degrees Celsius. After the material melts, it is taken out of the furnace and put into a mold. Once placed into the mold, it is put back into the furnace so that the materials mold together in the proper shape. While Baccarat uses modern technology in the manufacturing of its products, all items are still hand-blown. After the material molds properly and dries, the object must be decorated. One of the first decorations applied to the glass is a gold powder in a process known as gilding. Additional decorations will be added to the material after it's gilded. After the item is complete, you have the option to get the product engraved using stone or acid.